knowledge. <laughs> Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Inshallah, we will do the pronouns. Namirun munfasirun. Huwa huma hum. Hiya huma hunna. Anta antuma antum. Anti antuma antunna. Ana nahnu. Huwa huma hum. Hiya huma hunna. Anta antuma antum. Anti antuma antunna ana nahnu huwa huma hum hiya huma hunna anta antuma antum anti antuma antunna ana Now brothers and sisters, uh, lesson number four is very easy because you have already done so much of conjugation. Huh? But we will do it again, inshallah. Huh? We will do two Madi, and then we'll switch over to Mudarya because we want to practice Mudarya. So that when we come to lesson number nine, uh, you will have a gr great, you know, good time. You will have a good time because you will understand everything, inshallah, without difficulty. <coughs> so let us do Zahaba, brother. Uh, Madi. Zahaba. Zahaba. Zahabu. Zahabat, Zahabata, Zahabna, Zahabta, Zahabtuma, Zahabtum, Zahabti, Zahabtuma, 
ذہبتن ذہبت ذہبنا هو هي انا انت ذهبت انا ذهبت انا ذهبت كنت very clear نحن ذهبنا هم ذهبوا هن ذهبنا okay. الاولاد ذهبوا الاخوة ذهبوا الاولاد ذهبوا البنات ذهبنا البنات ذهبنا الناس ذهبوا النساء ذهبنا okay so we keep this in mind when we are uh, using it in the sentence we can put the proper verb form huh? if i say i went zahabtu he went zahaba are you with me now i am telling you in english he went zahaba she went zahaba they went masculine zahabu they went feminine zahabna you all went masculine zahabtum you all went feminine zahabtunna i went we went zahabna you went singular zahabta zahabta how about sister you went zahabti huh? are you with me one more time brother and sister i went we went zahabna huh? he went zahaba she went zahaba they went masculine zahab they went feminine zahabna you went singular zahabta huh? you went singular zahabta you went singular feminine zahabti mashallah mashallah <coughs> knowing this lesson number 4 is halwa puri ba very easy inshallah now we come to mudariya are you with me and we are slowly slowly learning the babs are you with me brothers and sisters so keeping that little poem in the mind you know okay fatuhu dam min nasara yansuru there is one bab nasara yansuru ha huh? okay fatuhu dam min nasara yansuru فاتح قصر درب يدرب فتهتاني فتهتاني فتح يفتح فتح يفتح so what is ذهب ذهب is the باب فتح ذهب يذهب فتا on ain kalima in the madi fata on ain kalima in the mudariya huh? okay are you with me brothers and sisters so let us try today uh, two of the fataha qasru and fataha tani let's do the bab daraba brother eventually we are going to shift ourselves to bab daraba bab nasara bab fataha you can also say a u a i a a you know inshallah so daraba brothers and sisters let us do daraba daraba yad ribu okay are you with me if i say yad ribu five in your pocket yad ribu tad ribu tad ribu ad ribu nad ribu so easy brother so easy now we do the whole conjugation huh? yadribu yadribani yadribuna hiya tadribu tadribani hunna yadribna hunna yadribna we come back to ya hunna yadribna anta tadribu tadribani antum tadribuna anti 
تدری بینا تدری بانی انتنا تدربنا انا ادربو نحنو ندربو got the idea one more time we do the whole thing ready yadribu yadribani yadribuna tadribu tadribani hunna yadribna anta tadribu tadribani tadribuna anti tadribina tadribani antunna tadribna انا ادرب نحن ندرب سي with practice with every step in our practice we make ourselves more strong and perfect brother now let us come to jalasa jalasa is bab daraba so what will you say jalasa yajlisu same pattern as yadribu ha yajlisu okay brother and sisters who are yajlisu yajlisani yajlisuna hiya tajlisu tajlisani hunna yajlisna okay anta tajlisu tajlisani tajlisuna anti anti tajlisina tajlisani antunna تجلسنا أنا أجلس نحن نجلس one more time ready brother and sister يجلس يجلسان يجلسون هي تجلس تجلسان هن يجلسنا أنت تجلس تجلسان tajlisuna anti tajlisina tajlisani tajlisna antunna tajlisna ana ajlisu nahnu najlisu very good brothers and sisters we have another nice verb brother here gasala is bab daraba what is it brother gasala is bab daraba so gasala yagsilu ha gasala yagsilu ready yagsilu yagsilani yagsiluna tagsilu tagsilani hunna yagsilna anta taglisu taglisani taglisuna anti taglisina taglisani antunna تجلسنا أنا أجلس نحن نجلس. Brother, in the beginning when you do all these fourteens, it seems like, my God, it's so much, but it is so easy. Once you get the hang of couple of patterns, then everything follows, and then your mind will just do the job, inshallah. Brother and sister, now we come to. Bab Fataha. Okay. What is in Bab Fataha? Ain Kalima has got Fatah. Huh? And then in the Mudariya also it has Fatah. Okay. Let's do Fataha. Ready? Fataha Yaftahu. Ready? Yaftahu. Yaftahani. Yaftahuna. Taftahu. Taftahani. And Hunna. Yaftahna. Yaf. تحنا يف تحنا أنت تفتح تفتحاني تفتحونا أنت تفتحينا تفتحاني أنتنا تفتحنا أنتنا تفتحنا أنا أفتح نحن نفتح كارد أيدي إن شاء الله very good okay Two more verbs we'll do, and we will keep on practicing of these two verbs. They are very beautiful verbs, brother. Saala yasalu. What is it? Saala 
Yes, Alu Bafata. Ready? Yes, Alu. Yes, Alani. Yes, Aluna. Here, Tas Alu. Tas Alani. Hunna. Yes, Alna. Yes, Alna. Anta Tas Alu. Tas Alani. Tas Aluna. Anti Tas Alina. Tas Alani. Antunna. Tas Alna. Antunna. Tas Alna. Ana As Alu. Nahnu Nas Alu. Inshallah. Karaa. Yakarau. Very beautiful verb. Yakarau. Yakaraani. Yakarauna. Hia. Takarau. Takaraani. Hunna. Yak Raana. Yak Raana. Hunna. Yak Raana. Anta. Takarau. Takaraani. Takarauna. Anti. Takaraina. Anti. Takaraina. Takaraani. Antuna. Takaraana. Antuna. Takaraana. Ana. Akarau. Nahnu. Nakarau. Got the idea, brother and sister? Inshallah. We'll keep on practicing every day, 10 minutes, 15 minutes. Very important, nice verb, which will come later on. Brother and sister, Darasa is Bab Nasara. What do I say? Darasa, he studied. Yad Rusu. Bab Nasara. Nasara Yan Sur. Okay? Darasa Yad Rusu. Very good. Yadrusu, he studies. Ready? Last one we are doing. Yadrusu, Yadrusani, Yadrusuni, Yadrusuna. Hiya, Tadrusu, Tadrusani. Hunna, Yadrusna. Hunna, Yadrusna. Anta, Tadrusu, Tadrusani. Tadurusuna anti tadurusina tadurusani antunna tadurusna ana adurusu nahnu nadurusu one more time the whole thing see if I say yadurusu five in your pocket yadurusu tadurusu tadurusu adurusu nadurusu so this is so easy brother ready yadurusu Yadrusani, Yadrusuna, Hiya, Tadrusu, Tadrusani, Hunna, Yadrusna, Hunna, Yadrusna, Anta, Tadrusu, Tadrusani, Tadrusuna, Anti, Tadrusina, Tadrusani, Antunna, Tadrusna, Ana. Adrusu, Nahnu, Nadrusu. Alhamdulillah. That's excellent, brothers and sisters. Okay. Now, brothers and sisters, you will look into this lesson four and you will watch how the verb Zahaba is used. But again, it's Mahdi. We should have no problem because we are fairly stronger in Mahdi and we are now getting to get stronger in mudariya slowly slowly okay so the whole idea is that we have to find a suitable form for the file that we are using are you with me watch how the verbs are used in a sentence and you also have to remember if they ask you abuka and in reply, it will become Abi. Yeah? If you say Ummuka, it will become Ummi. If it is said Akhwatuka, it will become Akhwati. If you are asked Ikhwatuka, then it will become Ikhwati. Your brother and then my brother. Huh? Watch for it, huh? inshallah. Okay, Yusuf and Ibrahim. My sister, Ibrahim is 
the nephew of Yusuf. Now Yusuf is, in our language we will call it Mamu, Khalu. So Ibrahim's mother and Yusuf are brothers and sisters. Are you with me? Ibrahim's mother and Yusuf are brothers and sisters. Okay, inshallah. Yusuf is coming to visit. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu. Ibrahim says, wa alaikum assalam wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu. Now this is a very nice sentence, brother. Ahlan wa sahlan wa marhaban bika. Uh, later on in book three, we will analyze the whole thing. But right now, you should only say, welcome. Huh? You are welcome. Huh? Ahlan wa sahlan wa marhaba, marhaban bika. Welcome. Ya khali, oh my uncle, from mother's side, oh my uncle, you are welcome. Huh? Welcome to you. Welcome to you. Kaifa haluka. How are you? La laka bi khair. I hope you are well. Huh? So brother, la Allah is min akhwatu inna. And what is ka? Ismu la Allah mansubun. Huh? And where is the khabar la Allah? Bi khair. Jarun wa majrurun. Shibu jumla khabar. La Allah. MashaAllah. MashaAllah. Very good brothers and sisters. Yusuf is replying, Alhamdulillah. Huh? Now the question is, Aina Abuka Ya Ibrahim? Aina Abuka Ya Ibrahim? Now he replies, then he has to use a suitable form of verb which fits the Abu. So what is the answer? Zahaba. And what is the answer? Zahaba. So it means he went. Are you with me? Zahaba ilasuki. Zahaba ilasuki means my father went to Su. No, he can. He could have also said Zahaba Abi. Huh? Abuka would would have become Abi. Zahaba Abi Elasuki. But instead of, he said Zahaba. Because you don't want to use uh, the nouns again and again. We use pronouns. Huh? We don't repeat nouns, but instead we use pronouns. Okay. So Zahaba Elasuki. Where is the file, brother? Zahaba is a verb. Where is the file? Mostatir. Takadiruhu huwa. And that huwa goes to Abi. But suppose if he had said, Zahaba Abi ila suki, then where would be the file be, brother? Then it will be Abu. Because Abi is two words. Mudaf, Mudafile. Are you with me? Maybe I should write down just to give you a little picture, brother and sister. Okay, fial plus brother, file mus ta tirun. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Now I write down zahaba abi ela suki. Where is the file now, brother? This is the verb. Where is the file? Abu. No, brother? Uh, okay, is the file. Okay. Plus it is mudaf. Sahi? And this is ya is. Mudaf 
Got the idea, brothers and sisters? So you will always look like that in the sentence. Okay? Especially if it is here and hua. Only in these two forms, hua and here, the file can be mustatir or the file can be maujud in the sentence. So if I say zahaba ila suki, means he went. Now he goes to my father. Huh? He went means mustatir. If I say zahaba bi, now the file is visible. Brother Muhammad, are you following me, brother, inshallah? Now Abu is the file. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? So both way, you know, you will see the file in the sentence. Right? If you watch for it, brothers and sisters. Wa'ayna ummuka and where is your mother? See how beautifully Dr. Abdurrahim is presenting the dialogue in which all the uh, verbs are used in a different way. Aina huh? ummuka. See now, ummu is a mornas. So what will you say now? Zahabat. Sahi. For father we said zahaba. Now for mother it will be zahabat. Huh? So zahabat ila khalati zainaba. Are you with me, brother and sister? Zahabat ila khalati zainaba. Okay, brother, let us analyze zahabat. Where is the verb? Zahaba. And what is ta? Tautanisi. What is it? Tautanisi. Got the idea, brother? Fine. We got our fiel and file. Now, ila khalati. How many words are there? Three words, mashallah. Huh? Three words. Ila harchar, khalati, isam majroor, wa huwa mudaf, and then ya mutakallim, mudaf ilahi. Then sister Maimuna, what is this Zainab is doing here? It is badal, mashallah. See now our mind can figure out it is badal. Sister Maimuna, it is Zainabi or Zainaba or Zainabu. So what should it be? Zainabi. Yeah, it is supposed to be Zainabi, but it cannot be Zainabi. So it, because it is dipped out, so it will be Zainaba. Now, is Zainaba Majroor or Mansub? Majroor. Why it is Majroor? Badal for what? Badal for what? It is a substitute for what? Khala? Khalati. Huh? See, I will write it down, huh, inshallah, so that you can have a good idea, brother. Ila khalati. So this is your result of ila. Harf jar isam majroor. Plus we have ya mutakalam. Mudaf and mudaf ilihi. Huh? Now, zai naba. Huh? This is majroor because it is a substitute for khalati. And khalati is majroor because of illa. Now, we haven't done it yet, we'll do in book three, but I will keep on now repeating, you know. Zainab is badal. If there is a badal, there is mubadal minhu. What is it called? Huh? I will write down. Huh? Mubdalun, mubdalun minhu. Means minhu is from it. Minhu is from it. Means the badal is coming from somewhere. So where is the mubdal from where the badal came? Huh? So it is khalati. Are you with me? Huh? 
from where the badal originated. Okay? Badal mubdal minhu. Are you with me? Badal and this is mubdal minhu. Don't worry if you don't get that thing. Huh? Please do not worry. It's not, badal is more important. Okay, that you figured out badal is good, alhamdulillah. But then remember, if there is a badal, it has to be, there has to be a mubadal minhu. Huh? From where the, in English you say from the, where the badal is coming, you know. Or the badal is the substitute of something, so what is that something? It is khalati. Badal is substitute of a noun, and what is that noun? Khalati. And if the khalati is majroor, the badal has to be majroor, huh? inshallah. And in book three, we will study all these things, inshallah. Fine. But alhamdulillah, you figured out that Zainab was badal. Very good. Wa aina ikhwatuka. Aina ikhwatuka. So ikhwatuka, brothers and sisters, plural. So what is the answer? Zahabu. Huh? Okay. Where is the verb? Zahabu. Where is the verb? Zahabu. Huh? Zahabu. This is your verb. Brother? And what is this? This is your file. Are you with me? This is your file. They went. So where is they? Where is they? Wow. Huh? Wow is Damir here, which means they. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Inshallah. Ela Jamiyati, we know Ela Jamiyati. Jar Majrur. Wa aina akhwatuka. And where are your sisters? Aina akhwatuka. Where are your sisters? Now, because now this is feminine. So what is the answer? Zahabna. See, don't you think it's easy, brothers and sisters? Because we have a good idea about the conjugation. Eh? Zahabna. Okay, brothers and sisters? Zahabna. There is the verb. Zahab. What is this? Fa'il. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Inshallah. Huh? You got the idea, huh? Very good, brothers and sisters. Ama zahabta. See, it's a question in negation. Okay, ama zahabta. What will be the meaning of ama zahabta? Didn't you go? What will be the thing? Didn't you go? Azahapta, did you go? Amazahapta, didn't you go? Are you with me? Azahapta, did you go? Amazahapta, didn't you go? Okay. Didn't you go ila madrasati al yauma? Make sure you write down al yauma. That is your zar. Al-Yawma is your Zarfu Zaman. See? No mudafilehi. Only Zarf. Didn't you go to the school today? What is the answer? Bala. Yes, indeed. Bala can be translated as yes, indeed. Zahabtu. Where is the verb? Zahab. Where is the file? Tu, mashallah. Wa raja'atu. Okay? Okay, brother and sister? Zahab tu. Raja'atu. So, this is very easy, brother. Where is the fial? Zahab. Where is, where is the fial? Two. Huh? Where is the fiel? Raja. Raja. Huh? With the sukun now. 
Where is the file? Two. Later on, when we do lesson number 27, 29, 28, we will go little more detail in, in the analysis of the verb, inshallah. Little more detail. But you have the general idea, fail and file. Okay? Zahab tu wa raja tu. Baad hissatil ula. Badal hissati al ula. Okay, brother, let us analyze baad. What is baad? Zarf. Huh? Is it zarf? Inshallah. And what is hissati? Mudafilihi. After zarf comes mudafilihi. Yeah? Without, you can close your eyes and say mudafilihi after zarf. If there is a noun there, and it will always be majroor, because mudafilihi is always majroor. Okay. And then what is al ula? Al hissati al ula? Not. Not, huh? Brother, you should have no doubts in these things now. Huh? Al hissati al ula. Huh? So this is al ula is the naat. Limaza rajata. Why did you return? Well, brother, he did not complete the day. He only came back after one period. Hissati is period. The first period. Are you with me, brother and sister? Well, Rajatu Badal Hissatil Ula means I returned after the first period. Limaza, why did you return? Rajatu. Uh, I return. Li Annani Maridun. Li Annani means because. Uh, now, what is Li Annani? Here we are learning something new, brother. Li, okay, is, is harf char actually. Huh? And what is this, brother? An. We studied in. Now this is an. Huh? Okay? So this is min akhwatu in. Now when you put li into anna, the translation is because. Li anna. Uh, Brother Abdul Samad, Brother Said, not li inna, li anna. Li anna means because. Okay? Now, brothers and sisters, li anna, because anna is there, okay? So we have to have ismu anna and khabar anna. Are you with me? Ismu anna and khabar anna. So li anna ni. Where is the khabar anna? Maridun. Got the idea? Inshallah you will remember. Huh? Okay. La basa. La basa. No problem. So now the whole li anna is not akhwatu inna. Are you with me? Inna has sisters. So, li anna, there is no such thing as li anna as a sister. Are you with me? What is the sister of inna? Anna. But together if you use anna with li, the translation is because. Can you use anna by itself? Of course we'll be using it a lot. We'll be using anna a lot. A lot. Huh? That. Huh? When you use Anna on its own, the translation is that. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? The translation is that. Okay? When we will be studying in detail, Inna wa akhwatu Inna, brother, Inna plus Anna plus La Kinna plus Ka Anna plus La Allah. And plus Laita. Ya Laitani Kuntu Turaban. Are you with me? Okay. So these are the sisters. How many sisters Inna has that we'll be studying? Anna, Lakinna, 
Ka'anna, we have studied them. La'alla, we have studied it. And we will be studying Laita. Huh? So here, Li'anna, Anna is the sister of Inna. And together the translation is Because. Now we will be watching for Ismu, Anna, and but Li Anna is not the sister of Inna. Anna is the sister of Inna. Fine, brothers and sisters. Where are we now? La Baasa. No problem. No problem. May no harm come to you. This is the meaning, brother. Write down, brothers and sisters. May no harm come to you. La Baasa. Huh? Dictionary will give you other meanings. For example, there is no objection to it. Huh? It's, no, it's acceptable. Huh? May no harm come to you. Are you with me? May no harm come to you. Okay? That is the meaning of Baasa. La Baasa. See, it's, it's mansub, huh? May no harm come to you. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Azahabta ilat tabibin. See, sing. It is tabibin indefinite. Azahabta ilat tabibin. What will be the translation? Did you go to a doctor? Did you go to a doctor? Huh? What is the answer? Naam. Zahabtu. What is Zahabtu? Fiel and file. Zahab, fiel and tu, file. Is it clear, brother? Very simple. And we understand it. Every sentence, every word we understand it. Aina Zahaba Abu Ibrahim Abu Ibrahima Abu Ibrahima is Mudaf Mudafilehi Abu Ibrahima Are you with me? Make sure you write down Ibrahima hmm? Because it is dipped out huh? Aina Zahaba Abu Ibrahima huh? Put Fata on Meme Ibrahim Ma. Hmm? What will be the answer? Zahaba ila suki. See, he went to the market. Very good. Wa aina zahabat ummuhu. See, zahaba came in the sentence. Where is the file? Abu. Are you with me? Huh? Next one, zahabat ummuhu. So, where is the file? Ummu, Ummu, wa huwa mudaf, and huwa mudafile. What will be your answer? Zahabat ila. Will you say khalati? If you say khalati, khalati hi. Instead of ya mutakalam, you will put he. He went, she went to her, uh, to his. Uh, Khala's house, okay? Watch this. Brother, when Ibrahim was asked, he said Khalati. Huh? See, when Ibrahim was asked, he said Zahaba ila Zahabat. Now we are answering. So we will say, she went ila ha la ti he. He goes for Ibrahim. Are you with me? How will you translate? She went to his khalas. 
because there is a kasra here, sister Nasreen, who will become he. Remember, we had studied. Why, who became he? Because there is a kasra before, you know. Remember, we say he, he, and we don't say he, who, like that. Huh? Okay. Kita, min kita, bi he, not min kita, bi who. We don't say that, you know.